So I'm here. I'm gonna get these both out the way because I I don't like to keep garbage around and well didn't sound right. One of these scents is total garbage, the other one is not. But I like to throw these in the recycling at my work. I don't want them to wind up in a landfill somewhere. So we're gonna go with this one. I gotta get the notes of this. I don't know why I didn't prepare, but I did not prepare for this one. What are the notes of Moonlight Path by Bath and Body Works? Moonlight Path. Okay. Uh, pow oh, powdery. Musky, lavender, woody, white floral, aromatic, floral, violet, fresh, and earthy. No. The notes. The notes on this one are lavender, which I like, bergamot, which I don't pick up on, violet, not a fan of, jasmine, not a fan of, lily of the valley, not a fan of, rose, didn't pick up on it, ylang ylang, did not pick up on it, musk, very musky. Sandalwood didn't pick up on it. Oak moss, hate that one. Vetiver didn't pick up on it. And there's they say amber, but there are no amber notes in here. Of the notes I picked up on. I picked up on violet, jasmine, lily of the valley, musk, and oak moss. Not a fan of any of those. Someone gave this to me. It was full sealed. I used it all. Terrible, terrible, terrible scent. Very powdery, super musky. Luckily, it doesn't last that long. It's pretty weak, so there's that. Um, and the, here's the one I'm really here for. What are the notes of coffee and whiskey by Bath and Body Works? According to Bath and Body Works, what it smells like, your favorite creamy brew made the Irish way. Fragrance notes, bold Irish whiskey, splash of vanilla, and hint of coffee. Get all of that. Super get all that. Now, there's some more notes in there. Um, I believe, so I'm going to go to fragrance to go just to double check. Co oh, that gives me less. Just coffee and whiskey. Simple. It's more of a, a Arabica coffee, so not like a sweet coffee, but very dark kind of spicy will bite you in the nose kind of coffee you do get some vanilla in here a little bit and the whiskey on this one is very very prominent not like a super boozy whiskey but like a warming kind of gives it a warming sensation this one is worth it and i think both of these are the same price they're all 1350 this you can't pay me 1350 to take this i would pay like 1350 again if I didn't have so much to go through this this is a good one really really like this one um good quality you only get 10 ounces or yeah 10 ounces which I feel like you should get at least 15 or 20 whatever it's still a good quality body wash uh when I had it in the shower yeah, both of these actually when I had them in the shower they filled up the bathroom totally Add a little bit of heat and you start washing with this thing. This thing. These are going to be loud in the bathroom. And then very quickly calm down. Um, neither one of them lasts very long. These are more for like the gym or going to bed or something like that, you know. Um, but this one, this one is great fragrance. They both leave you clean, skin moisturized. Um, I would not get this one again. This one I absolutely loved. They're, they're simple. Anyone who's had a Bath and Body Works body wash, they're simple. It is what it is. I don't want to make these videos too long. I want to try to keep them short. Peace, and y'all have a good day.